had a nice rest last night? Isaiah 32 verse 17 says, The fruit of that righteousness will be peace. Its effect will be quietness and confidence forever. <gasps> Wouldn't you like to be peaceful, quiet and confident forever? I know people that are so confident in who they are and what they are doing. And they look like, and they are successful. And they are doing what they want to do in their business and in their lives. And sometimes when you speak to them, they're actually not that confident. They just know how to kind of fake it till they make it. And I wish I could be like that sometimes. But I'm not like that. Sometimes I'm, I lack confidence. And I look for quietness and peace. And then I read a verse like this and I think, oh, am I not trying to be righteous? Am I not bearing the fruit? Because somewhere in the New Testament it talks about the fruit of the Spirit. But there's also this fruit of righteousness. There's a being a certain way and then a, a fruit, something that we then gain from bring, being that way. Am I not being righteous? Because I do, often don't have peace, quietness, and confidence. Don't you just love it when people come into a room and, and people are going, this is, you're not doing this right. And, and then they, they, they literally have an air of quiet confidence about them. I've had that sometimes. And I really like it. Because I know that I know what I'm supposed to do. And nobody can change my mind. And that to me is a, a wonderful thing. I know that when I sit here with you in the morning, I am doing the right thing. This is one of the places I can be quietly confident of what God wants from me. My videos aren't perfect, and, and you'll see in the background these bottles, and I just see there, and I think, oh, actually, that's not what's supposed to be in the background. But that's my labor. That's what I do. That's who I am. Not who I am, but what I do. That's what I do for work. And so that's a very real part of who I am and very real look at my life. <laughs> Bottles everywhere. There's always a bottle somewhere. Righteousness will be peace and its effect will be quietness and confidence forever. I once asked God for peace and he gave me storms. And I said, I didn't ask for storms, Lord. When I asked you for peace, I was looking for that river with that weeping willow so I can go and sit under it and just meditate. God said anybody can do that. Break through that rock of hoping for nobody around you, hoping for no storms. Those that have true peace have peace within the storm. How do I do that, Lord? Well, when you are in Christ, you are righteous. That righteousness is peace. The world can come to an end, but the righteousness you find in Christ, not in yourself, but in Christ, it's a righteousness you deserve when you just go, here I am, Lord, have me. That is an awesome righteousness. And that is your peace, not the weeping willow at a river, but the Christ that envelops you within him and within his righteousness. Can you find your peace there? And then you will have quietness and confidence forever. He's whispered something in your ear. You just carry on doing it. You don't ask for opinions. I ask for opinions all the time. You just are confident in what you have heard. Take some doing. See if you can do it. I'm going to try. Have a wonderful day and we'll speak again tomorrow.